Yoshi Side Pier. This is Bill Litchfield. Bill is my monthly uh, reporter, tells me what's going on down here, gives me a report. Introduced me to a few of the regulars and get some stories what goes on out here at the, at the pier. And uh, I've fished the pier since 1960, the week before I got married, 1966. Wow. wow. <laughs> Didn't have a good day, but, <laughs> but I, it was a long time ago. But uh, uh, I'm not a regular, so these these are the ex the true experts. Uh, maybe you can introduce us to a few of the sure. the regulars and. Yeah. and one is right here. This is my friend Ernie. Hi, Ernie. And he's the halibut king. Yeah. The halibut king. Ah. Yeah, yeah. He's I, the, I've catch I've, some halibut. I've but been to many piers, and a lot of them have different halibut have halibut kings. Mm. Right, right, right. And I'm going to go to uh, Balboa Pier Tuesday morning and see the halibut queen, which is <laughs> which is Snooky. <laughs> She's been fishing since uh, before me even. Right. So, uh, so you're the halibut king. So I, what? What are some of the big, hell, what's the biggest halibut you've caught out here, would you say? I would say right around 30 inch. Oh, good. Yeah, 30 yeah. inch, yeah. And um, what do you, do you use, live bait or what's yes, your uh, primarily live bait, live smelt, bait. sardines, anchovies, whatever you can find out here. Okay. So it's, it's. And you, is this, this is a typical tackle? Or? Yeah, it's a typical tackle. It's a 20 pound uh, main and about a 15 pound liter. Uh -huh. uh, it's just a, your normal. Uh, oh, there we go. Yeah, it's just normal bait and you know, hook it through the nose and uh, sinker, right? And, kind of, and kind of like, yeah, kind of a Carolina. It's a Carolina, Carolina rig, rigging, yeah. Pretty much, yeah. And yeah. Uh, it's a very lightweight. I get, I get about half ounce. It, it's, half ounce, yeah. It, it takes, you know, the, the fish is taken by the current and and where the fish are. You know, hopefully. Most of the time, it's live smelt. Uh, yes. I suppose maybe like, little baby uh, walleye perch are good bait. Yeah, perch will be uh, good if you could catch them, but yeah. smelts plenty around here. Yeah, <laughs> so, and they'll they'll do nicely for for bass, for halibut. Yeah. Um, so how often, fish. You, how often do you get out here to fish? I primarily fish the weekends. Weekends. Yeah, just the weekends, the mornings, and you know. Yeah. It, Bill's out, out here most of the time, so I say hi to him. So <laughs> he gives me the reports. And, and, and I give everybody the report. Yeah. Right. And then he, right. yeah. Then he gives me the report. There you go. So, yeah. The, so the synergistic effort. <laughs> yeah. It's, pretty much. Yeah. And, and, great. You know, if the fishing's great. You know. It, so you, it should be. This it. is uh, middle of May. In my book, I always talk about primary uh, halibut season is from about the first of May till. The, say the end of October, does that yeah, kind of match it, what you it gets, see? It gets, um, so, so right around that area, fishing tends to be good, Yeah. but towards the winter, um, fishing slows down, but bigger halibut comes in. That's, uh, what I, that's what I said in my book. I said, you don't catch as many in the winter? Correct. Sometimes but, the biggest ones are in the winter. Right, right. Yeah. And that's that's when they move somewhat closer to shore. And so, you know, you, you fish, I fished the beach right around that time. Yeah. Because uh, the, you know, yeah, and, and also time it during the grunion runs. So oh yeah, right, right, grunion, right before you know the week before or the week after, it's good time to. I always to tell fish people during the grunion runs, it's a great time to catch halibut, and a great time to catch bat rays. Uh, <laughs> a lot of bat rays are fishing tends too. to be good when when it's right around oh, yeah, the grunion runs. Oh yeah, a lot of runs. a lot of food yeah, in the water. Yeah, a lot of food in the water. A lot of corbinas, a lot of uh, you know. Yeah. I've caught corbinas on this, and so it's like with with a live bait. So. It's now for corbini, you probably use sand crab or uh... no, no. I was fishing uh, sardines. Really? Yeah, but they they were small enough, and, and the fish were, were hungry enough. To, to just they're hungry, they bite anything. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. So. Well, great. We don't want to interrupt too much of your fishing, but uh... I'm about done. <laughs> <laughs> I put no, hal no halibut it. today, huh? No halibut, but just uh, bass and, and you know a, a lot of sardines. Uh, oh yeah, yeah. Sardines so, and mackerel are around. Yeah, yeah. Well, good talking to well, you. Good meeting you. Hey, we hope that you watch our peer fishing videos. We have two aims. One aim is to educate people how to be better anglers. And secondly, we hope we entertain you a little bit. Hope you enjoy these films. Watch the films. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. And keep watching.